Hey guys, how you doing today? It's me, Kelly. I want to show you guys real quick these Sharpie uh, China markers. I've used these a million times before, um, but for those of you who have been who write me, who have been watching older videos of mine where I use the Stabilo, which I love the Stabilo. Um, you can see I this is my last little piece left. I love it, um, but I know a lot of you can't afford it. A lot of you can't. Um, afford sometimes shipping um, from Amazon if you're not a Prime member and that type of thing. So I want to show you these because you're going to be seeing me use these uh, Sharpies a lot. Also these Sharpies, you get a two-pack. Uh, these both came in here. You get them at Hobby Lobby for $2.99. Um, but I'm sure AC Moore, Joanne's, Michael's, you know, all those kind of things, they sell them as well since it is Sharpie, probably even Walmart. Um, you know, for about $2.99, $3, you can use a coupon and get them, you know, for a little over $1.50 for two. So they're very, very affordable. And you get two of them in there. Let me show you real quick what this uh, pencil does um, compared to what the Stabilo does. So I have here, this is the... Um, Satin Americana Multi Surface Paint. This is my delicious green uh, multi surface satin paint in Granny Smith. This is a red acrylic paint. This is a watercolor, right? This is my watercolor, and this is a watercolor pencil. Now, these have a tendency to be a little bit more waxy. These are like your gelatos, your uh, the Reeves. Um, you know, the Reeves water, water soluble crayons, all those kind of things. Okay. So this is what we have so far. And then what I'm going to do here is I'm going to just draw and you can see it right. It's just, just as nice <laughs> as the Stabilo does. Now, what I like to do, you can see on here, this is the way they sharpened it. I don't know how well you can see that, but I like to take a knife or even on a piece of paper. And I like to make the point a little bit more pointy for me when I'm drawing, but you don't have to. So let me show you. Um, and you can see right there as I dropped it out of my hand. So you're talking about satin paint here. This is just regular acrylic paint. Um, but look how it writes it. Now my, my paint might not be all the way dry, but look at this, how beautiful it writes over it. So if you're like me and you like the quotes and sayings and all that kind of stuff, I know some people it drives batty. Um, they don't like all the quotes and all that kind of stuff. I happen to love them. I love quotes because I love to put them on Facebook or wherever to remind people, you know, rem when you're having to be a bad day or whatever, you know what I mean? I love them. So to each their own, but you can see this writes on here. Great. This dark num this dark paint, Look how nice that writes on there. This is a uh, watercolor. Writes really good on there. And then this is the uh, gelato type uh, crayon, right? Water soluble crayon. So you can see it writes on all of these. So if you are, um, you know, like me who does art journaling and mixed media and you love writing or uh, these are great because <laughs> This is great, and you'll see in a video I have coming up where I use these because you see how I have that written there? I use this as a um, a part of my mixed media. And what I mean by that is um, I'll have, you know, my things painted down, maybe things glued down, whatever I do, and then I'll add little, you know, you can draw little hearts or you can draw a smile, whatever it is, and then I'll go over it with paint as well. So you can see right here, it's not smearing, I'm pushing my finger on there. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the only difference that I have found between the Stabilo and this is this is not water soluble. So um, I have this, my water's dirty, so excuse that, but you can see, listen, it's not going anywhere. Look. It's not smearing. It's not doing anything. So this, besides having my dirty uh, water there, <laughs> gotta change that water, Cal. I've been doing a lot of stuff. So, um, so you can see it's it's not water soluble. It is not reactivated. So I love this for a million other reasons than I love the Stabilo. Do I love the Stabilo still? Yeah, I'll bet your pants I do. Um, but I'm just I'm really digging this, and it goes on glass and metal and plastic, over your acrylic paint, over watercolor, over your uh, water soluble gelatos or what have you. So this is just, I, I, I just, I really like it. I really like it. You're going to see me using these a lot. I wanted just to give you a quick tip for those of you who have written me. I, I, 
one of my biggest emails I get, uh, one of them is about the Stabilos because I know that I had many, many videos where I was using them um, and I created art and all that kind of stuff. And I still love my Stabilos and everything, but I've been using these and these are much more uh, accessible for uh, us to get at this, you know, for us, people who do not go out all the time, disabled, for us who are uh, tight on money or what have you, you definitely can um, use these and really use these uh, to your advantage in your art journaling or your mixed media. So keep an eye out for me using them. As always, please be kind to each other. You never know what battle somebody else is fighting. I love you guys so, so very much. And um, let me know down below if you want me to uh, do a giveaway. It's just going to be for one of these pencils. If you, you know, if you're willing, I'd like to share with you, let me know down below. And if you don't, then that's okay. Cause I know it's not very, a very exciting, uh, giveaway, but I just love sharing these. Like I said, these, these are just going to be so fun. So I will see you guys later. Have a fantastic day.